1981's strangely titled Demonoid is a lot like tying your shoe one-handed. It's awkward, it takes a long time, and the end result is loose and barely put together. Demonoid's story concerns the devil's favorite mm, stranger, old Lefty, which was released by two bumbling white boomers from a sarcophagus deep in a Mexican mine. Filled with one-handed mummies, this tomb appears to have been focused on the left-hand path of magic. That's the dark side, folks. Sure enough, the evil inside awakens and reanimates from some premium bone cane on the boomer's coffee table. This hand of glory then launches into a death grip that infects anyone it touches, causing them to turn into big jerks. The first jerk blows up the mine and hightails it to California. There, someone finally gives a brother a hand, and it turns out to be the devil's. Ain't that a bitch. From here, the movie shows us idiot after idiot becoming infected with the hand, causing mischief, then cutting off their left hand so it can high-five the next sucker. Scenes range from brutal amputations, senseless car chases, and Super Mario cosplay. I have to give the movie a hand for at least having decent special effects. Some moments really look like a disconnected hand is crawling across the scenery. There's a nifty underscored scream every time the hand flies across the screen too. Yeah, which is probably the movie's most creative idea. There's something to be said about the music too, which is done in such a way that it sounds like a full-on disco band and Latin chanting is in the room with the actors. It's an interesting choice, but it's thematically completely at odds with what's going on in the movie, most times. What a shame. You would think with such a nifty soundtrack, decent effects, and handy camera work in its palms that it would be a snap for Demonoid to be a decent horror movie. Unfortunately, there are too many things that cramp this movie's style. The most memorable scenes are laughable, like a man serving up his hand like a birthday cake, or confusing, like corpses turning into old people for absolutely no reason. Most of all, Demonoid has a completely stupid, repetitive ending that seems to communicate the director has no idea how to end things. All of it robs the movie of being anything more than the sound of one hand clapping. One out of five fingers, and you know which one it is.